Hey guys, you're Marty Geek. In this video, I'm playing a little bit of Super Mario Maker 2 in TV mode on the Nintendo Switch. Of course, I already did upload a video in portable mode. And um, here, I'm going to continue with the story mode because it's the mode that I've been playing the most. I've been playing uh, this mode a lot. Um, here is um, early recording that I did um, right after I did the portable mode. I continued played here in TV mode. I connected it to my Elgato and started playing here a little bit. And like you see, the foundation is already done. This guy's still sleeping there. <laughs> I still don't know when he's gonna wake up, but I'm pretty sure he's gonna wake up soon. And um, you want job? Just gonna keep on doing some jobs here. We got call underground coin collector. Blah 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 blah. Reach to go, grabbing all 30 coins. All coins, not 30, 30 coins. It's got to be more than 30 coins there. Um, I will be editing the loading time a little bit here and there. It's not because the loading time is long. It's because I want to share as much gameplay as I can. Uh, but the loading times are basically like five seconds. You know, it's it's really good. So, and, and when it comes to Nintendo games, you know, Nintendo, they do a great job. Better than anybody in on the Nintendo platform. Um, you know getting the best out of the console and so here with this game. There's no exception. This game runs incredibly smooth here on the Nintendo switch and uh, Most of the levels especially the levels that are with uh, like a 3d world or no, not 3d world the the Mario Wii U versions and the Mario 3d world they looked incredible these, of course, are more pixelated because uh, this, I think it, this is from the first. No, I think this is Mario 2, right? I don't know. Because um, for me, these games, I am not very nostalgic when it comes to these Mario. Oh, we died. <laughs> when it comes to these Mario classic games, because back in the day when these games were popular in the 80s and 90, early 90s, I was not a gamer. I was not a gamer. I used to play video games with my friends at the, my friend's house with the Genesis, the Super Nintendo, the Sega, and all that. But I was ne I never owned uh, a console. I did own one, but me and my brother, we never. We were always ignoring the systems. We we were more into toys and and movies and girls than video games. Uh, plus, I didn't like the way they look. For me, they always look. I don't know. Moving pixels on the screen, jumping and all that. Eh, not a huge fan. But, you know, for those that know and been following me, you know that um, the game console that actually made me the gamer that I am today is the PlayStation 1. But since the PlayStation 1, I've been addicted to video games. I've been playing video games from PlayStation, Xbox, and the latest um, Nintendo consoles like the GameCube and Nintendo Switch. But... Let's speak a more. Okay, okay, look at that. We got, oh my god, that 10 coin actually made it. Okay, there you go. I needed that 10 coin at the end there to pass the 30 points of the per 30 coins. There you go. There you go. So we got 150, 41, 223, and oh my god, this is barely just starting. So we got 9% there. You see, there's going to be a lot of gaming in this game. A lot of gaming, because like you see, there's only 99% there. Uh, this is my traps, shoo shoo, probably don't smell great, but you can always press R to take them off. Okay, la 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 la, la 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 la. Let's go and do this too. Okay. Shoe stopper. I thought it was shoe stepper. Oh yeah. Okay, so here, of course, I died a couple times already, and when that message comes out, it happens when you die a whole bunch of times. Um, and that part that you see in the bottom, the left corner, says parts with the negative button. Uh, you press that if you want to, uh, like, um, add or, uh, like, some life or extra life or extra power-ups. You can press that, and you can see power-ups on the screen that you can actually use. Here we're gonna go ahead. I guess we can't hit that. Okay, there you go. 
Soundtrack is really cool. You know, nice soundtrack in this game. Every level has its own nice sounds going for it. So I think here we all, all we have to do is finish it. Uh, okay, oh, we better not jump down there because there, there's a big, huge void right there. We're going to fall through. And same thing over there. Nope, we better not jump. Let's go ahead back over here. There you go. Oh, we got a tan coin there. Uh-huh. Can't go down there. Oh, crap. Let's go ahead here again. Upside down. Oh my god, almost fell through that void. There you go. But I gotta say, this game so far feels awesome. I've really been enjoying it. Um, I did um, try the uh, construction area, the workplace, I think is where you build your levels. And it's really cool. It works amazingly good here on the Nintendo Switch. When I was watching these gameplay over and over again on E3 and all that, uh, the more I saw the construction and building your levels, the more I was not liking this game. Because, like I said before, I don't like building stuff. I just don't like building games. I like playing the games, not building them. So, But the cool thing here is that you can um, download and play levels from other creators and it's amazing to see all the awesome imagination people have and all the great skills that people have to make these levels so i'm gonna try to upload another video let me know if you guys want to see another video of showing um some of the levels that you can get okay man yeah Building, I'm horrible. I try, I could try it and build something, but <laughs> it will not look good. <laughs> okay, so we got that. What else? Okay, 150, 73. Not bad. 13%. Damn. We still got a lot to do here. So let's go ahead and do another mission here. You know what? I'm going to have to buy another controller. <laughs> because the controller that I've been using, I don't, I don't know. It's not like accurate. That accurate. Uh, Banzai Bale Ambush. Su seesaw Catapults. Banzai Bills. Guarding the place. Okay, let's go ahead and do this one. Okay. Okay, this one's cool. This one's cool. I did try this one. But I didn't finish it because I said, you know what? Let me go ahead and leave it for the video. Then I quit. And here you can turn into a cat. Pretty cool. You could jump here on top. You avoid, of course, you got to avoid getting hit by those. Try to get as much coins as you can. It's so cool. These levels with, uh, I think this is from Wii U, right? I think this is from, from the Wii U. Mario, Wii U, something like that. Uh, they look so incredible. The colors, really, really nice. In the Mario 3D world, really beautiful. Oh, no, no. We got a 10 coin there, but I don't think I can break it by stomping on them. Uh, Graphic-wise, this game, of course, looks incredible. Just like every Nintendo game, not disappointed at all. I don't know what Nintendo... Nintendo knows their own... Their own, their own code secret to, to make the games pop up a lot better than every other third-party developer. I 
think if... Oh, no! Oh, crap. Did we... We were in checkpoint, right? Yeah. Yeah, we were in checkpoint. There you go. Yes. And I think we were about to finish the level too. I'm telling you guys, if Nintendo shared their secret recipe, their secret sauce, how to do... Get the most out of the games, out of the consoles, man, there would be a lot better um, ports and third-party developer games here on the Nintendo Switch. Because every game that Nintendo does looks incredible. Every Nintendo game, in my opinion, looks way better than any third-party game that you can find on the console. Everyone. Every game. And it's because Nintendo knows. Nintendo knows their secret recipe. How to make their games pop out and how to get the most out of their consoles they know they don't share it <laughs> i guess they don't share it because i'm pretty sure if all the developers knew the secret sauce they would do, do the same thing right okay there you go boom boom okay so we got 150 plus 59 over 800 coins and this is done main hall first floor yeah <laughs> there you go so like you see there that is done nice main hall first floor is complete it's just so beautiful it's gonna be huge compared to the original building so we got that to build and we got the east hall to build first floor that's cool okay and here we jump in forward here we jump in forward to like you see 29 percent like you see there 29 percent and the castle look at that the castle looks nice and great now i'm building the west side second floor and uh, we're gonna do some missions here that I already done but the cool thing here about this game is that even when you do missions that you've done before this guy is still sleeping I don't know when he's gonna wake up um, we got the eraser dude and the eraser dude is actually gonna take the bricks out of there and you're gonna be able to go down here and this guy will actually give you missions um, that you're gonna be able to do for like uh, this is not for coins. This is like for uh, clothes or something like that uh, But the missions you don't have to take them from them because once you talk to them It's gonna appear at in the taskmaster master or giver or whatever uh, Here same thing with him. He has missions that will give you um, He actually deleted the wall that was here. There was a wall right here if you saw my prior video and he was the one who erased it so I did a mission. You have to first do a mission, then he'll say, okay, I'll erase this wall for you. And you got these two dudes up here. Uh, you could take missions from them as well. And But I'm not gonna do the mission right now for this guy because I already did try it kind of hard. <laughs> uh, but I'm just walking around just to show you that all the sections of the castle that's done already, this guy is doing the second floor of the west side and like see there he's pretty busy <laughs> so there you go for there you go so let's go ahead and do a mission some of the missions that i've done already hey you want some jobs okay there's a whole bunch of missions that are going to be unlocking there look at that whole bunch of them different difficulty levels um i'm gonna go ahead and do a mission that i really liked Let's see no jumping allowed awesome mission i loved it it's gonna do that so i can share with you guys there you go let it load so in this level at first it was kind of annoying but i just had to i had to actually look on go to youtube and say how the hell do you beat this you can't jump you can't land if you're on the uh, if you're like on a on a brick you can't land even if you're not jumping because it'll automatically disqualify um, you from winning or ending this level. So this is how you do it. Here you go. 
And like you see, very cool. I love the aesthetics. I love the soundtrack, the background noise, sound. Um, it feels, it, re it reminds me a lot of Luigi's Mansion. I see this and I, I can't wait to play it because you see the ghost. Gonna look away. Okay, look forward again. There you go, get some coins. There you go, get this guy. We gotta get up there. There you go. Just remember, without jumping. Man, at first I was, tr I tried this. I died here so many times. Not died, but I, I kept jumping. I was like, God damn it. Okay, there you go. Okay, we got Mr. Boo. We got a ghost right there. Look away. Look back again. Let's go. Ah! Stop it. Don't follow me. There you go. Ah, crap. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I could have got that, but he already ate that. The mushroom. Okay. Okay, so this one right here is a little bit tricky because you have to make the ghost come over here and the bomb, let the bomb blow up. Oh, crap. Too far. If you if you make him come a little bit closer to the 30 coin, he, the, the coin will actually drop. So you got to try to make him get as close as possible to the 30 coin. Okay. Oh, I thought I would die here. I thought that guy was smashing me. There you go. Over here, if you hurry up... Uh, if you hurry up there, you can actually get that 10... The 10 coin, but... We failed to do that, so we're gonna get out of here. And this is it. Right here. We're gonna try to get a lift... By this guy. Let's go ahead and... Look away. There you go. Just remember not to jump. I kept messing up this video over and over again because I kept accidentally pressing the the jump button instead of the dash button. <laughs> so, there you go. And we got it. Remember, don't jump. Just let him get there. And we're done. Mario time. There you go. So we got that done. And so like I was saying before, the cool thing is even if you've done these missions before, you're still going to get the progression going up. Like you see there, now the, the progression, even though we did that before, the progression is still going to continue. So that's the cool thing about doing the missions again. Uh, you could get some of the coins that you were not be able to get. Uh, that's one hot car. Let's go and do this one. I really like that one too. Okay, this is uh, okay. I think this. I know which one is this one. Okay. Oh yeah, this one is a really cool one. And like you see, very cool colors. There you go. Try to get as much coins as you can, because remember, you're not gonna get since you're doing the missions again. You're not gonna be doing the getting the full price. Which I think it was like 200. There you go. Ah, crap. Seriously? There you go. Oh, gotta be careful with those. So, like I said before, I already did upload a video in portable mode. I hope you actually watched that video. Um, and I, which I, I think I started. I started playing the story mode there. And here, of course, I always, I always feel the need to upload a video in TV mode because I know a lot of people rather see gameplay like this 
than in portable mode but I do a lot of portable mode videos for those that are new to my channel because I love mobile gaming I'm a huge mobile gaming fan even even mobile gaming on phones I'm a huge fan so being able to play these games on the go that's how I like to share my videos my experience as a mobile gamer uh, the same way I used to do with the PlayStation Vita I'm doing here with the Nintendo Switch because that's how that's this is my mobile console <laughs> I played the Nintendo Switch on the go, wherever I go. Um, at home, I mainly play my PS4. And lately, I've been playing a lot uh, PC. Lately, I've been playing a lot PC. Uh, thanks to um, Xbox Game Pass on PC. Come on. Please don't tell me I'm going to die here. Okay. Woo! Man, so close. We almost died there. Get out. Okay, we're almost done here. Get this coin. Ah, this coin disappeared. Okay, this is the part, last part of this level. Hope we don't die here. Gotta try to hit that. Uncover this axe. Ooh. What's up, baby Bowser? <laughs> We're not gonna kill him like that. You can't. Doesn't matter how much you shoot at him, you're not gonna kill him at all. So don't even waste time. You just gotta hit this. There you go. Ah, come on. Charge. Woo! There you go. Right, charge. There you go. We got it. We got it. That's it. <laughs> so that's it, guys. That is it. I hope you actually liked the video. Let me know in the comments what you think about this game so far. I gotta say, I am loving it. Um, it does get challenging. It does get challenging, but there's so much. There's so many different kind of missions to do. Look at that. We just finished the West Hall second floor. Yeah. And we're only 32% only 32 percent so there's going to be a lot of gaming here in story mode i'm wow and i'm loving it i'm loving it so far so i'm gonna try to upload another video in uh portable modes just to show you guys uh the building how the building features work here and how to download games um levels from others let me know in the comments if you want to see that video and um other than that i'm gonna keep on here see what we can do uh, we got this um, thing right here. Let's see. Over here, did he? Um, he finished, but sometimes you got to talk to them because maybe they'll give you like a mission. Okay, once the right through, huh? We'll be finished. Okay, I guess not. I, guess I thought he was going to give me a mission. But, guys, thanks for watching this video. This was super mario maker 2 on the nintendo switch story mode in tv mode thanks for watching guys till next time bye bye